Hello and welcome back to Elden Ring. We're in Mogwin Palace, as you can see. And we got a bunch of these uh, Albanarix down here. They're just walking around this tree nice and slowly. And these guys are actually worth quite a few runes. So I was wondering if there was a way that I could easily take them out. I mean, you saw in the last episode, there was one guy who had uh, glowing eyes. And uh, we took him out like this. I mean, this works great. You know, from up here, it just takes some patience and some aim. Good lord, terrible aim. <laughs> What's wrong with me? Um, so this is this is time consuming. It's it's totally safe, perfectly safe way to take these guys out. You get twenty four hundred runes as, as a result. But I was wondering if there was like some something I could use to you know, take out a bunch of them at the same time. And I'm wondering if these... Man, I could make 18 of these. I, I wonder if these volcano pods would be worth it. Um, oh, crap. I gotta put them in my inventory. So I have to wait for them to come around again before I can uh, do this. But yeah, I'm gonna throw a volcano pod at them and see how it goes. But we gotta wait a while for them to come back around. I mean, they're slow. They're very slow. I mean, I actually kind of think that I might as well go ahead and just start shooting at some of them while they're coming around here. Right in the face. I like how he looks up at me like, how dare you? How dare you, sir? The problem with doing this, though, is that it looks like it slows the other guys down, but at least they're all grouping up now, so when they come around this corner here... I should be able to uh, throw a pot at them and do maximum damage. Check them all out down there, all grouped together. I don't know how far I could throw. It'd be great if I could just throw it right here in the middle of all of them. Oh. oh okay, so he decided to do some rolling there. Oh, dog on it. Well, I mean, it is doing a bit of damage to them, but not a whole lot. Doesn't really seem like a great way to take a bunch of these dudes out at the same time. Yeah, look at that. It'll take a while to kill them all that way. Uh, I don't really have any good spells that work over a distance, so none of these are going to help. You know, like, Bestial Sling is real cool, except... You know, you gotta be close to them. So, yeah, this, um, this is looking like it's not a good method at all. I wish I could throw it far enough that I actually get it to land on him. But I guess I just don't have a strong enough arm. Because I'm always, like, throwing it at their feet. Look at, look at that. Maybe getting close. And they get mad and roll away. <laughs> I just love how they're looking up here at me. Oh, he's got a shield. Oh, man, in the face. Oh, he's just angry. Can't say that I blame him. So, yeah, this is uh, time-consuming. This is not... I don't feel like a good method to do this. But, you know, if you're patient, you really can just stay up here forever and just shoot these guys take them all out and I guess that really aren't there items that I could take that would give me even more yeah boosts rune acquisition for a time I've only got four of these though you know I mean are they really that valuable I don't know that they I only have four of them uh, I could also try you know, to throw different kinds of pots down here. Where are my pots? Yeah, I've got some Giant's Flame Fire pots that we could throw as well, but I doubt I could throw them any further than I was throwing the other ones, and now they're all on the other side of the tree. So, yeah, this... I was thinking this would be a great place to come and... farm some runes real quick. And it is... I'm sure it is a great place, but... It does take some time. 
I never noticed this guy hanging from this tree right here. <laughs> Just shot him in the side of the head. So they're coming back around the mountain here. So that does do some damage, but... Apparently I can't throw it far enough to really uh, get the job done here. Are these jerks a little moving around business? Oh, he's got a shield. So, uh, yeah, I'm kind of thinking so much for that idea. But I tell you, when you get down here with a uh, torrent, these guys... They, uh, they'll hit Torrent. Look at that. Take too many hits to kill them. Oh, now I'm off Torrent. And they've, they've killed me once before. Really don't want to get killed by them again. Oh, darn it. Oh, darn it. Get away from me. Come on, dude. Doggone it. I'm pressing the button. God, that's the most frustrating thing. Pressing the button to take health, and then he does it. That is the most frustrating thing for me. That is so frustrating. Take health already, dude. What the heck are you waiting for? So I got nearly 100,000 runes sitting over there that uh, we obviously want to go and grab real quick. So let's go do that. Um, yeah, these guys are just tough against poor old Torrent here. Still don't know the answer to the skeleton over there. How you uh, stop the skeleton from spawning. So, we've got 98,000 runes. Man, still, look at that one hit from him and I'm off the course. I took way more hits than I thought he would. Oh, gee whiz, these guys are the worst. Oh, hey, look, some stuff to pick up. Uh, let's see here. Do I have enough to level up? Not quite yet. Let's go ahead. Well, this guy's got a stupid shield, though. No, stop that. Stop it. All right, he's down. A couple more of those guys and we'll have enough to level up. And, I mean, look at all these guys here with their backs to us. Oh, they've turned around, unfortunately. And, uh... Oh my gosh, these guys... They're nasty. They are nasty. You get one of these guys rolling into you. They stagger you. And then uh, you're in big trouble. Here comes one of them now. Oh man, they just aim right on you. Oh, right there. Uh, hold on a minute, I'm going to turn on my light. Ah. Okay. Well, we certainly have enough runes to level up now. Let's go on up this hill. I think there's a slot site up here for us to rest at. I believe so. Pick up more smithing stones. What's this guy's story? Take care of him. Man, these guys have shields. Gosh, look how many of them. I feel like I'm playing a mod. Boy, there is no dodging these guys. Really hate how many hits it takes to kill them. Oh, jeez. I mean, I feel like I am such a high enough level now that be killing these guys with one hit. <laughs> That's how I feel. I demand one hit kills. So you do a good strong attack. Get him quicker. Oh, he's spewing stuff on me. I'm not sure what it is. It doesn't seem to leave any effect on me. This is a lot of runes I'm running around with. Not used to that. 
not used to that at all. So if these guys are just going to sit here, I mean, they're worth just as many runes as the guys that fight back. So, this is just, look, I, I, were there this many of these guys here when we were here before? I really don't remember seeing this many dudes, especially this many that just sit here and don't even fight back. I just find this insane. Look at this. Just sitting there. I do a charge strong attack against him. And uh, it stuns him or whatever. And then I hit him again and he's dead. Lots of runes up here for us. I mean, look, look at him. He doesn't even care. Look at this guy. He doesn't care. He doesn't care what's up. Look at this poor little guy. I almost feel bad. Almost. So there's a site right there. But there's still a few more dudes here for us to take out. And they're free runes. Why not? They don't seem to drop anything, though. Uh, these guys. Up to 155,000 runes. That, uh, that's, that's a lot of runes for me to be carrying around. I don't feel comfortable with it. I'm going to go ahead and level up over here. So I received a great comment that I need to go back and read again and like really study. I'm talking about if I boost my arcane and my faith a little bit, um, it really starts to open up some other things that I can do. Let's go ahead and get our faith to 15. And then we'll start working on arcane. But yeah, it looks like there's some some incantations I could put on my weapons, which uh, makes them a lot more powerful, and I'm intrigued. So uh, we'll definitely look into that. So I mean, look at this. Just a ton of these dudes here. They don't fight back. They're worth. Oh, one of them's going to fight back. They're worth a fair amount of runes. Son of a gun, he almost killed me. I mean, I've got some armor on too, man. Good God. Get another one. But you can see the runes just piling up. Yeah, we need to help heal ourselves every once in a while. But this is just what a place to. Oh, he's going to fight back. No, no. Ouch! Stop it! Not enough stamina here, but I want to see if I can't get enough runes to level up again. This is kind of crazy to me. So I don't have enough runes to level up yet. We got this group of dudes down here, but to be honest with you, I think it maybe makes more sense to just go up and rest again. Respawn all these losers who don't fight back. And um, just uh, quickly get enough runes to level up again. We've got to get up to 108. So let's see if we could do that. I also want to know, so I looked a moment ago, my inventory for this uh, dude here, Gold Pickled Foul Foot. I've only got four of them. Can I craft any of these? I can. I can craft 12 of these, but only 12 because I need four Toad Foul Foots. I don't know where we get those from, but apparently this whole game I've only collected 12 of them. But, um... Let's go ahead and use one of these things. I don't know how long they last. Let's, see, let's use one. And um, we'll see. Uh, we'll two-hand it here, too. See if we can't speed up this process. 30, 3188. Runage. Fortunately, we got this guy coming in here ruining my fun. 
Come on, lock on, game. Lock on. Okay. So these guys are now all worth 3188. One two-handed charged swing gets rid of those guys. Where'd this guy go? This one that's gonna give me trouble. I'm at 107. I don't have I don't quite have enough to level up yet. Nope. Stop that. Okay. That is enough to level up. So yeah, this is a great place to do some farming. Huh, actually, you know what? I still have the effect of this um foul foot, so I guess I should take advantage of it, shouldn't I? Go ahead and keep on reaping the, the rewards here. Okay, I don't really want to deal with two of these guys at the same time. I really don't. Oh, jeez. So I... Looks like I still have the added benefits of the foul foot. Don't know how long it lasts, but it's still, still there. Love the one hit kill. You know I'm a fan of that. Big time fan. I see you there. He's pretty smart though. If he just sits perfectly still, there's a chance I won't see him. So there's more down the hill there, but they fight back. So, wow, how long does this last? If I rest. Does it reset it? That's kind of what I want to know. Also kind of looking up the hill here to see if there's any more of them up here. I don't think there are. Yeah, I kind of hate to waste this thing because I'm pretty sure resting is going to reset it. So I feel like I should go down here and try to take these guys on. It could be a mistake, though. Could be a mistake. Where are they? They're all down the hill here. gonna die. Okay, don't want to get backed into a corner here. Uh, okay, so the effect is worn off. So I'm gonna go ahead and run on up the hill here. I'm not gonna risk it anymore. Got enough runes to level up. I'm gonna put it into Arcane. I think I want to get that up to 10, maybe? I don't know. I have to go back and read that email. I'm excited at the possibilities of what I could do with just a boost in some of these things. Okay, well, I mean, we're gonna keep going up the hill here. Um, not real sure what my ultimate goal is here other than just re-explore this place. So the game knows that I've been here. Like that's just a path back to where we just were. Lots of dukist herba here. Not sure what I use that for, but we've got plenty of it now. Here is gold rune eleven. So this place is just throwing, throwing runes at us. Please, sir, please take these runes and these dukist herbas. And here are some formic rocks. Where do I go from here? Um, where do I go? Did I miss a... I'm kind of remembering this from last time I was here. I got a little... I remember being a little confused as to where to go. Where do I go from here? We're just running around over here. Where do I want to go ultimately? Over here to the mausoleum? Gosh, there's all this over here. Is this where we just were? Yeah, I think... Okay, so this is the... 
first rest area. Over here, I think, is where that skeleton is. And over here is the blood area where there's a bunch of those Albinarix. But I'm over here now. So I guess maybe we came up this way. I don't know, man. Where do I go from here? I don't know. I don't know where to go. How do I get over here? Go down this way and go around? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Oh, hey, look. Can't miss that. For some reason, I thought there was a way up here. But yeah, I guess it's kind of looking like there isn't, huh? And I guess this is just a dead end. Huh. Um, yeah, I'm kind of confused. It's such a weird place. Weird little dead end area here. Well, I guess you just come up here for the goodies and then you move on. Could drop down here. And then this just takes us back here. So, um, okay. I mean, it's called Palace Approach Ledge Road, which leads me to believe that it takes you to the palace, but this is just a dead end. So... Don't like the way that guy's eyeballing me here. Okay, there's a little cave here. This takes us over here. There's something big down here. Maybe we've got a bird. There's a nasty bird over there. Super nasty bird. Okay, we don't want to go down there. Item over here, but this bird's going to see me as soon as I get over here. Oh, Nomadic Warriors Cookbook 24. Uh, I guess he didn't see me because of the tree, maybe. I don't know. A record of crafting techniques left by roaming nomad warriors. Contains knowledge for surviving in the face of utter scarcity. Acquire the knowledge to craft the following. Swarm pot and roped fly pot. Okay. Oh, he sees me. Oh, crap. I don't know if I want to fight this damn bird. I do want these items, though. Oh, missed that item, dog on it. There's one over here. No, I didn't. Okay. I think the game made me hop off of Torrent there. I didn't want to. The game was like, yeah, I had to hop off Torrent there. Oh, invaded by nameless white mask. Okay, now this is getting nasty. I don't want to fight the mask dude and the bird at the same time. Rot grease, three of those. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna run over here and grab this. So is that why I got thrown off of Torrent? Because I was invaded maybe? Oh, jeez, bird, get away from me. Okay, so somebody's... Oh, okay. Oh, you jerk, get away from me, jerky jerkerson. Is he fighting the bird back there? It'd be awesome if he was. I don't know what the hell's going on, man. Just trying to get out. Oh, gosh, there's birds everywhere. Just looking for a nice place to do this fight. Oh, gosh, away from the bird. Get away from me, bird. I got enough business to take care of. Get away from me. Can't fight you and this invader at the same time. Oh, jeez. There's another one. Oh, this place is terrible. This place is the worst. I take it all back. Caleb isn't the worst place this is. Nameless White Mask. 
Oh, what's that? No, 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 no. Ouch. Oh, good gosh. Oh, 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 oh. Damn it. Ah, shoot. You stupid jerk. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. What am I doing wrong over here? What am I doing wrong? I had to get all the way back over there. I was hoping I could see my runes from here. I mean, easier said than done getting back over here. These guys are quick. They'll roll right into you. And bad things will happen. Oh man, this is bad. This is real bad. Here in a moment, I'm probably going to get kicked off of the torrent. When I get invaded. No? Okay, let's uh, pick this up. Stone Sword Key. Let's get our runes back. Okay, we got our runes back. I feel a little bit better. Oh, you son of a gun! Oh, gosh. Gosh, the amount of damage we're doing with this thing is not much. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh, oh, and the scrub. Oh yeah. Give a little scrub shot there. Oh my gosh. Yeah, okay, we got him. Whoa, 13,000 runes. Okay, that's that's what I'm talking about right there. 13,000 runes. Yes, please. But uh, there's a bunch of these dudes over here. Ooh, this is a challenge. This is a bit of a challenge. So that weapon I was using... Ooh, Halleck Drake Talisman plus two. Do I want that? Let's see what this does. Talisman depicting a trio of golden ancient dragons vastly boosts holy damage negation. Don't think there's a lot of holy damage going on around here, I don't think. The ancient dragons who ruled in the prehistoric era before the Erd Tree would protect their lord as a wall of living rock. And so it is that the shape of the dragon has become a symbolic of all manner of protections. What does this wall look like this? Uh, so, I mean, we're doing like 600 damage per swing against these birds, which is really good damage per swing, but holy cow, these birds have so much, so much HP that uh, it's tough to kill them. They are a challenge. They are a bit of a challenge. Am I up for the challenge? Yep, here we go. Oh yeah, lay on the ground. The most bizarre. <laughs> the most bizarre attack. Oh, 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 he's doing the funky chicken. Oh my god, she's so close. Okay. 13,000 runes, thank you very much. And thank you for the flask. Thank you, thank you. Much appreciated. So, we do need to go over there at some point, back to where we were invaded, and take care of that guy. Man, even he's worth 2,000 runes. My goodness. Yeah. More doggies. Is that a dead end? Does it go anywhere? Interior leaf. This place is kind of freaking me out a little bit. A little bit. A little bit of a freak out. Freaking me out. 
This just looks like like those those like laser lights that you shine on the front of your house, you know. You know what I'm talking about. Makes it look like there's lights on your house or some kind of effect. Uh, we got another bird over there. Wouldn't mind trying to take out the birds before they get invaded. See if we can't get this guy's attention, bring him over here. Come on over here, bro. That got me. Good job. Empty shields. I'm always ruining my crit by hitting them. Oh, I did it again. Oh well, we'll finish him off. Okay. Another 13,000 runes. Thank you very much. And a flask, which is very, very valuable out here in the middle of nowhere. I have no idea if these spraying pools of blood are a problem or not. I'm gonna try to avoid them, because they're probably bad. Uh, clarifying boluses, I believe we just picked up. some grave sites, gravestones. Whoa. Okay, we've been invaded. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Got him. Okay. 379 runes. I mean, what the hell is that? What kind of in insult is that? You get invaded and you get 379 runes. That's a freaking joke. Okay, if we come back over this way, uh, we're gonna start making our way back over to where these guys were patrolling. And I don't know if I need to go back over there. I don't know if there's any more items out there that I haven't picked up yet. So I hesitate to go back out there because those guys have handed me my butt several times already. Just trying to see if I see any items. Could be something over here. I think there's a bunch of bodies here. I don't think I did that. Yeah, this is just... Oh, look at him coming up out of the water. Or the blood. Oh, interesting. Um, Just... This is the path that leads up to where all those sleeping dudes are or whatever. Okay, I think... I think we've cleared this place out. I think. So, I think we can move on from here. Let's take a quick look around this tree. See, that's the problem. Those things are so quick. They'll knock me clean off of torrents. Okay, we're gonna leave those guys be. Look at the effect of the blood as torrent runs through it. It's pretty cool. See over here. Grab ourselves melted mushroom. Let's see, is there anything else? Up here? Whoa! Okay, I've been kicked off of torrent again. A bird over there. Oh, uh, okay, we've been invaded by nameless white mask again. Where is he? Let's bring him over here. There's a little bit of space to fight out of the blood. There he is. Alright, let's see how this goes. Let's 
see I'm using my finesse. Right, finish him off. For another 379. Another 379 runes. What a joke. What an absolute joke. Don't waste my time. Is there anything else over here that I'm interested in? There's another bird over there. Don't know if I'm too terribly interested in fighting a bird in that muck. But I mean, 13,000 runes is 13,000 runes. Something shiny over there. It's just a rock, I think. Bunch of dogs up on these rocks here. What was over here to acquire? Uh, some blood tainted excrements. God, I hate to think of what I would craft from blood tainted excrements. That's just nasty. These dogs are just sitting here minding their own business, and then here I come. I haven't noticed how many runes I get from the dogs. Oh, ooh, there's a tree up there. Get another golden seed. Have to figure out how to get over there. First, we're going to look in this direction. See if there's any items. Oh, we'll just get kicked off the horse again. Why did I get kicked off the horse again? I'm getting invaded again? What the hell? All right, well, we're gonna pull him over here onto solid ground away from the bird. That is my preferred way to fight. Okay, come on over here, jerk. Oh, he's gonna be smart. Yeah, Bloodhounds Finesse. Another. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, all right, pursuant. Vanquished, nameless, white mask has died. We had to kill him three times, apparently. You get white mask, war surgeon gown altered, war surgeon gloves, and war surgeon trouser. Trousers? You know, trousers, you know. You put them on your legs, trousers. Let's take a look. blood-stained, faintly grinning white mask worn by war surgeons who were effectively mercy killers. The Lord of Blood's curse enlivens the wearer when bloodletting occurs, slightly raises attack power when there is blood loss nearby. Interesting. Here we've got War Surgeon Gown altered blood-stained white gown of the war surgeons who were effectively mercy killers. Of the surgeons that were abducted by the Lord of Blood, none were able to tame the accursed blood. None but Vare, that is, though he was an exception. Here we've got War Surgeon Gloves, no new text here. And then finally, the pants, again, no new text. And we can run around looking like this if we really wanted to. Do I want to? I don't know. Uh, I guess we're going to go take out this bird over here. Um, just for completion's sake. And, um, oh, we need, also need to go over there and get um, that uh, golden seed. So let's see if we can't take care of these things. Oh, crap. How do I get over there? I can't jump there from here. This should work. <laughs> I like how he goes flying. Is there another dog up here? 
No. There's not, but there is a bird. Got ourselves another golden seed. And I think I need a lot more golden seeds in order to level up my flasks now. Let's see what happens. Can he fly? Oh, pfft. Oh, okay. up here? He can. Oh, I'm not going to like fighting up here, I don't think. Oh, no, I'm not going to like this at all. Oh, what's he doing? Show me his butt. Weird bird. Oh, oh it's going to hurt. Oh, he's doing this business. Okay, well, I'll just hang out down here while you go flopping around up there. I don't like being in this corner at all. Is that kitty? We got it. Okay. Okay. Well, we have enough to level up again now, which is exciting. I'm excited. Well, there's an item here, all right. On this dog that fell off. These bones. Don't to get too excited about there. Okay. So, we fought a bunch of birds. We fought... The death mask guy several times. And, um... It's gonna do a run around here just to see if there's anything else we're interested in picking up. We already looted that body. Okay, it might be time to move on from this horrid place. Oh, I just took a drink. Tap the wrong button. It's okay though. I think there's another site up here, I hope. Now, up the hill here, it gets pretty hairy if I remember correctly. And then once you get up here, there's like this dark cave that is just a nightmare. And there's also a merchant in this cave up here, which is just, as far as I'm concerned, a horrible location for a merchant. I don't know why he decided to set up shop where he did, but. Uh, I can't imagine he gets too much business. Unless the bad guys also buy stuff from him. Where do I go from here? Somewhere over here there's a... There's a way up, isn't there? Here's an item that I missed. Uh, hello, I'd like to pick up this item, please. Thank you, holy grease. Are these more live dogs? They are! Good lord! A lot of doggage. Oh. Stop it. Huh. Can't believe there's another rock with with dogs on it. Thought I'd seen all of them. But obviously not. It really makes me wonder about other things that I've missed around here. Ooh, man, this is uh, this is a bit of work here, but uh, we're making it. Is this um? There was a cave over here, right? That we need to go through. I think it's this way? Is it, or is this a dead end? Crap, it is. Now what do I do? I thought I saw the path before. Huh. Hmm. I remember there being like a narrow path that we go up. I don't, I don't remember where it is. This is just going to take us back. Oh. Do I need to go back to here and go the other direction? Is that what I need to do? Kind of makes me wonder about this whole area out here. What's the purpose of it? It doesn't really take me anywhere. It seems like it's just a big dead end. But I mean, 
since I'm here, I do want to... Oh, somebody, somebody just died from somewhere. I didn't know anybody was left alive out here. Who was that? Oh, I sure as heck can't go that way. Up there is where we need to be. Not a ledge for us to drop down over. Huh, this is craziness. This is craziness. I'm calling it. This is craziness. I like to think that we've cleared this place out and that there's no reason for us to ever come back here. I'm sure you guys will tell me if I'm mistaken. I hope I don't have to come back here. I don't like it here. I don't like it at all. So, we are going to go back here now. Still don't know how to get rid of the skeleton dude permanently. Maybe you never do, I don't know. But yeah, we need to go up this way. That's going to take us up that narrow path. Or you need to level up again. Put a little bit into our cane. I'm going to hang out here in this, near the safety of this side of grace. When we come back next time, we will go up those stairs. The narrow path that takes us up here takes us ultimately up here to the mausoleum. There's a boss up here that I don't think I've beaten. Don't think I ever beat him. Um, we may take him on in the next episode. I'm not sure. It's a bit of a slog getting to him. So who knows? But anyway, one thing that is for sure is that this episode ends here, and I sure hope you guys had a good time. It was cool to level up so many times. That was satisfying. Hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, you can let me know by leaving a like or a comment. I sure would appreciate that. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you join me again in the next episode.